46, your report is twice six involved in an injury accident. We're going to begin with a Detroit fire truck crashing into a home while on the ways to a high rise fire. Glad you're with us tonight at 11. Four firefighters were hurt in that crash, including one ejected from the truck. Two other vehicles also involved in the crash with one of the drivers in critical condition. Mar McDonald is on Detroit's east side as investigators try to figure out who was at fault. As you can see, this scene is an absolute mess. They've been cleaning it up for hours. Tow trucks everywhere, police cars. What happened here was a substantial crash. This is where squad six ended up in the side of a house after getting into an accident at the intersection of East Forest and McClellan. The fire truck and this Mercedes colliding. The truck clips a utility pole, which then falls onto another SUV. Now, the driver of the SUV is shaken up but okay. The driver of the Mercedes, according to police, is a 50 year old woman who's in critical condition after the wreck. It's always an accident right here. Always. Neighbors say tonight's wreck is the fifth one in as many weeks. We need the speed bumps. We need whatever we need. They fly down this street 90 miles an hour every day. Every day. Detroit police reconstructing exactly how this accident went down and who's at fault. All four of those Detroit firefighters who were taken to the hospital have been released, we're told, with bumps and bruises. As far as the scene out here, it's going to take hours to clean all this up. We are on Detroit's east side. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4.